accessories and jewelry have a huge impact on our style. But since the past few years, we have gone a little far from our jewelry box. But since the days are going back to normal, we are taking a look at 8 jewelry that you need to try in 2023. Welcome to Design La Mode and let's go to this video. First, we're going to look at bold earrings. Why? Well, during the pandemic, as we're wearing masks more often, we couldn't use earrings because all of the heavy weight was on our ears. So now we are taking a revenge by wearing bold and big earrings. Everything you could think of. You can go multiple hoops, colors, bold and gold and silver, or even culture and ethnical patterns go as bold as you wish even match it with a bold necklace it could be long or thick so it could match almost any style and it's a good news for maximalists because they like everything bolder even if you don't like to go that exaggerated you can always be dainty but maybe use a jewel or something that's more shiny so it's showing better of course you can go bigger in your hoops if you just like to keep things more simple or add a little more dazzle to your normal hoops by adding some additions to it and make it even more fun so now it's your turn to have all the bold fun And now, since we are still on the bold era, it's time for bold cuffs. Yes, we are going all over the place with getting bigger and better. It's getting more colorful, bolder. You can add bedazzles, make your cuffs longer with gold, pearls, silver, and all the variations that you could think of. Cuffs are shown worn in two hands or just one with a couple of cuffs. You can use one bold and thick one or another things to just make a nice collection or you can go all in and wear both of the cuffs in both hands in different colors or you can use a variation which uses different types of chains and patterns. The good part about this trend is that you can wear it in summer because it's just perfect. Next is time for your greens. Green has always been in the fashion. Open up your jewelry box and see if we have any green accessories left. I think we all have one green. It's not just for St. Patrick's Day. It could be worn for every day. As seen in celebrities, a lot of them have chosen green because it just shows elegance, richness, and just it's beautiful. Well, not all of us could afford diamond jewelry and emeralds, but you can go in with the green color. There is no shame. So if you just can't afford it, like a lot of us, go with green accessories. It could be in any material or even use it in your clothing. If you don't want to dip your toes in the emerald green, go for other ranges of green like in grass green or even a nice light green color. Next, we are in punk and chains. As in Y2K, punk is back. But of course, not all of us are in punk phase, but that doesn't stop us to go for the craze. Well, all we know about punk is going extreme with chains and spikes, wearing colorful clothes with dashes of black and also showing off your opinion. Well, it's not all into that punk if you just want to step up into the trend. You can go with leather accessories, but the importance here is on using more chains. Cartier chains have been in fashion forever, but we are just going up a notch by adding them almost everywhere. You can add them to your glasses, yes, that's even an option and count it as an accessory or even use them layered because it's very stylish, not so punk, but it's still use of chains. Pearls, 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 pearls. Always in fashion, elegant, a classic. 
is just a statement in everyone's collection. We all have a nice pair of pills, even it's heirloom or gifted, it just makes us feel better. You can be super chic, feminine, elegant and sophisticated by just wearing a pearl necklace. Yes, that's it. Pearls are the superstar. Well, this time we are again leveling it up by making it bolder, thicker, bigger and layered. When we say pearls, it's going all in. You can wear your pearl necklaces in your clothes with lots of layered necklaces in big and chunky parts or even if you just like pearls, you can still stick to the normal pearl necklaces that's very dainty. You can step it up by just adding another layer of pearl necklace if you don't like it long and a little earring which is super feminine and beautiful. Of course, a pearl choker is a perfect sophistication for a strapless dress to make you glamorous. And if you like to just look more fashionable, go in pearls with colors. Use them in the variation of colors like black, red, in your earrings, in your bracelets, or go with just one big pearl in the pendant for the middle. Well, as I always said, it's go big or go home. So you can wear it all over the place. You can wear it with everything in every color, sizes and length and you still look trendy. Another trick to enjoy pearls is actually wearing them in a different way. You can wear them as a backward necklace, meaning that the length is more lean toward the back of the dress so that you have some surprise when someone is looking at you from the back and it's like a surprise. Well. We think that everyone must have a pearl necklace. It just depends on your style. If you like to just be a little different, you can go with a variation of smaller and bigger pearl necklaces. Heart has its reasons. Yes, it always has, and it's not logical. Well, we are in the Y2K phase, and there is no surprise that hearts are bad. We are seeing them everywhere from unisex accessories to necklaces, even worn on clothes as brooch, hats, bracelets, and earrings in different shapes and sizes. And one of the most interesting comebacks of this shape is in earrings, necklaces, and rings. Well, you can go very dainty or go all big. Next we have DIY, let's make it fashion. We all love some DIY, we have done it and we either hate it or love it. It's a double-edged sword. But you can make it wearable, it's all about making it fashion. It doesn't have to look perfect or even symmetrical. Well, that doesn't mean you have to go to your garage or downstairs with your fancy equipment and everything to make some accessories. No, actually this year it's all about accessibility and fun. You can sit on your bed, on your bench and just look around in your room and see what you have in hand. Do you have some beads, some um, pendants or even pearls? Well, go in, use your chains, make it punk, make it all the styles that you want. You have the freedom to choose your color, length, style and everything you could think of. The fun thing about this trend is that you can make it very unique to yourself and no one could have the identical item. So it's all about having the experience of wearing something and telling a story. You can use DIY accessories in your clothes, in your earrings or if you just don't have the time to make something from scratch, look around in the accessories that you already have and try to mix and match them and make something new. That's always an option and you can find even a new use for something that you actually didn't like. Femfleur. It's French, feminine, women and flowers. We all love it. It's so soft and beautiful and the combination of women and flowers is just unexplainable. 
it's so soft and with the hot pink being in fashion right now we are seeing a softer version of this trend in using flowers again it's much bolder or could be softer depending on your style but use flowers even real ones in every matter that you can you can put them in your hair as accessories use them as earrings or rings and hey it's spring we have lots of flower in hand so that's just a perfect time to use them and think about it fresh flowers have a good scent too or you can go ahead and choose some jewelry and accessories that have a flower element to them for example they look like flowers or they are leaf shaped or even petal shaped but nevertheless going bold is the point of this video go bold or go home this year we want to show off all the revenge that we have from the accessories well what do you think did you like this video do you wear pearls or chains or even both well let us know in the comments what did you like the most from this video and which one would you actually wear even Tell us your style, which one is your favorite or do you want to experiment with different accessories? As always, you know that we always read all of your comments, we are waiting for your suggestions and we are just glad that you stick to the end of this video. Before you go, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see more fashion hacks, tips and tricks and so much more coming. If you liked it, share it with your friends and ring the bell icon to be notified from our future videos. Before you go, we have some videos prepared for you to watch, so click here to watch some more fashion tips and trends of 2023, and we'll see you later in the next video. Bye!